Last year, Lincoln View FCA advisor Matt Langdon challenged the leaders to write down some faith questions they had. Then junior Bailey Neat wanted to know why God hadn't shown her any big signs in her life. A few days later, the 17-year-old was in a car accident that totaled her car and another. I remember getting out of the car and being so scared and all I was doing was crying the whole time and freaking out and my heart was pounding and um, you know I was so sorry that the accident had happened. I was so sorry the whole time. I kept saying, you know, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I didn't mean to, I didn't know. The airbags deployed and I had been told by one of the firefighters that they had never seen an accident this bad that those two people walked away from with only a couple scratches. That same night there was an FCA lock-in that Neek was looking forward to. My mom was like, I don't know if you should go, you should probably stay home, but you know, I told her, no, that's where I want to be. If I'm going to be anywhere, I want to go to that FCA lock-in and I want to you know, be with all the people that I love being around and all the, the people that were there that night at the accident and taking me and um, the other friend to the hospital, you know, all that stuff to get checked out. It was, I wanted to be there with them. We went to the lock-in and God met her in that church. It just kind of hit me right there that, you know, we were saved for a purpose and uh, before that, my uncle had died. Um, he died on November 1st down at the state cross country meet the night before my brother was running. He had died that night. He had Down syndrome and he lived to be 65 and so it was amazing and, and I just remember being so crushed that night and at the funeral, um, a week and a half before the accident at the funeral, um, I picked up a prayer card that my grandma had made with a prayer on the back and my uncle's picture on the front and it had been hanging in my car. Um, and when we went to go see my car afterwards, it was absolutely totaled. They called us and they said, you know, come get as much stuff out of it as you can, as much stuff as you can recover out of it because it's, you know, it's pretty trashed. So the pictures that I had hanging were, you know, thrown everywhere and ripped up. And the one picture that was left there on the, the top of my sun visor was um, my Uncle Ben's picture and, and that prayer card. And that just absolutely touched my heart. I knew from the very second that I saw that, that, you know, this was God and this was the reason that it was there. 